Welcome to the Windows and Computer channel and uh, this is to answer some questions that I get regularly and there's another one today, one that is a different one about Windows updates, you know, is there a way to see how long an update actually took on a machine? Uh, and the person is mentioning, well, you know, it takes 15 minutes on my computer and how come I see people telling me it takes three hours? And um, there's a lot of things that happen with Windows updates that can make that time differ from machine to machine. Honestly, um, people that complain that it's two to three hours often have computers that are very underpowered. They are slow computers and with old mechanical hard drives. Um, Windows updates themselves are very quick. But when you have an old PC, of course, all the work that it has to do is heavier on the machine. So an older machine will take a longer time. An example, my eight-year-old Core i5 Toshiba installed the update in about, I'd say, 55 minutes to almost an hour. That's an eight-year-old Toshiba Core i5. Now, take somebody that would have the same type of machine, but uh, Core i3 or just a, you know, a dual core, those older technologies. I can easily see it go to an hour and a half, two hours, but it's because of old uh, PCs that don't really perform well, uh, much more than anything else. On my main machine, which is a gaming laptop, I'll be very fair, uh, my PC took, I don't think it took more than 10 minutes total from the download to the install phase. Um, you know, if you just look at the install phase, it was like two or three minutes, not even. It was really, really super quick to a point where you look at it because you go see if your update really installed because it was so fast. So it gives you an idea that when the computer is very recent, um, if you have an SSD drive, these updates are very quick in general. Um, and these machines, usually these updates rarely take more than, you know, 15 minutes, 20 minutes. You know, what is really long is the feature updates, big reinstall of windows. That's longer. That takes more time. But even that on a machine like I have is roughly, you know, 45 minutes to an hour and that's it. So the speed depends first of all, on the age of your computer and the technologies that it uses so the older the computer and if you're not on an ssd drive you know a mechanical hard drive are slower uh, and some mechanical hard drives are actually very slow in performance also that will make install of windows updates real long um, the other thing also is depending on what you do with your pc all the software you've got installed the more you install stuff, the third-party antiviruses and so on, the slower these updates can be also because of that. So that's why there's such a huge difference in install times between computers. Uh, a lot of people tend to keep their computers very, very long, many years. Well, it that that's where it will show that these updates might take a long time to install because... You know, the older technology is slower at processing all of the uh, all of the things that uh, Windows Update needs to do. File transfers and all of that are slower. And uh, like I said, old me mechanical hard drives. You know, one thing that people sometimes might not see is that uh, their hard drive over time loses performance because it gets old, has a little more errors, and has less speed to it to do the same job. So it's really, really a question of old computers versus newer computers versus the technologies that will be in there. Another thing that also I see a lot and I've seen while I was doing my tech jobs is that people tend to buy the lower end PCs most of the time. These will technically take a longer time to do everything because they don't have the same power as you know more expensive laptops or, or computers that have the latest technologies and it's all a question of you know how much money you want to spend on a computer so that's where all the diversity of time installed is is amazing and uh, yep 
I mine is uh, five to ten minutes, but uh, yes, somebody could have a two-hour install for the same thing on a very old PC with an old mechanical hard drive. Uh, like I said, my Toshiba, my main Toshiba laptop with an old mechanical hard drive uh, that was uh, that is eight year old. Uh, Core i five, you know, I mean, it's not the uh, the lowest powered one for the time, but still took almost an hour to do the same thing that my laptop took five to ten minutes. And there's no real way to really see how long it took to install an update. Um, it, you know, it, it just takes the time that it takes, but there's no time counter. There's no way to really know of, uh, a, of the time that it took for a specific machine, unless you were looking at it and actually looked at the clock and, and measured how much time it took. Uh, but it is really uh, different. Uh, people complaining that it's very long are, are complaining to the wrong uh, to, to, to Microsoft for, for, for the wrong reasons. It's very long because you have an older machine, you have a slow machine. It's, it's, it goes you know hand in hand. It's like everything else that you install on a computer. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.